at least the last 10 years we we started uh, thinking and researching about the use of technology to improve the teaching and learning processes we have now a lot of data a lot of studies that shows different results and different improvements in different stages and in different areas and on how technology can really uh, help teachers and professors and also help the, the students to to learn to teach to to, to get knowledge, to create something. So I really think technology can, can do that. Maybe the most uh, trending or facey name is the MOOCs, the Massive Online Open Courses. But I'm not sure if it's the, the, the real or the only path that we have to, to take into account. So a lot of people is talking about MOOCs and maybe we are losing some other platforms or some other tools that were very helpful and were very powerful to to students and to professors so i think we have to try to to bring again all the tools analyze them and compare it and see if only MOOCs is the way to to go to the future or we have to take into account also other other tools that we have to we used to have and now we we should reconsider how we will use it in the future for example blogs wikis um, these tools that were starting to get uh, specific uses in the education for example um, online platforms like moodle or other content where um, it has a different uh, kind of interaction as mooc uh, mainly for the word massive the word massive and the implications of being massive has a huge impact on the process so i think that other tools let uh, being more focused on other aspects of the teaching and learning process and maybe we should rethink if we are losing something on that way technology can help us in the teaching and learning processes people studying stem degrees or stem subjects definitely they have to, to to use technology to interact with the content and with the others to really understand the 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 technology it's behind the tools that they use and to to really get into the into the process that builds that technology so it's not only using the technology as a tool for learning it's also a, a way to understand how technology works that will empower the the learning of the, the stems.